Dear students, my name is Raju Prajapati and I am founder of AgriVision for you. I have done my masters in food technology. Basically, it was an international master degree in food science and technology from IT Guardian. Now, if you say food technology, it has a different names in uh, colleges. Somewhere it is food engineering technology, somewhere it is food science and technology, somewhere it is food science only. And degrees or, or uh, you know varieties of courses. Uh, it differs from B.Sc. four years degree or B.Tech four years degree or B.Sc. three years degree. So these are the sub, uh, you know, wherever you will go to different different places. Uh, let it be in Tamil Nadu, B.Tech or in Kerala, it is food engineering technology. So generally, this is the name. Now, as a food technologist, it's it's a very new emerging field of uh, engineering or or say sciences, right? Now. It is not so known for students who are studying in uh, BTEC food engineering and food technology colleges. What are the opportunities? Uh, you know, major opportunities. What will do after four years? Either we should go for masters, either we should go for jobs or private jobs, or you know, let it be corporate jobs. What is going to be the best? Right. Today we are going to discuss about one of the opportunities among various, which is masters. Now, for any food technologist. We have streams call in gate examination, gate XC and gate XL. So for those who don't know, gate uh, it's a graduate aptitude test in engineering. Generally, we can appear as a B Tech students in third year and fourth year of our uh, uh, bachelors. Now, in gate XC and gate XL, if we are going to discuss both of that, many of the students also ask, uh, you know, what is the difference between that? Back when I was studying in my B.Tech in Kerala Agriculture University, uh, uh, you know, we even didn't have idea that okay, so we as a student we can appear in Gate XL as well, right? So since our seniors was doing in Gate XC, we also attempted to Gate XC. Now, so but any food technologist can appear into the any examination, let it be Gate XC and Gate XL. So now, Gate XC, Gate XC has compulsory subjects as general aptitude and mathematics. Now we have two options that we have to select. Goes for thirty-five and thirty-five marks. Fifteen marks is for general aptitude and fifteen marks for engineering mathematics. Now, uh, you know, among seven XC uh, uh, optionals, soil mechanics, thermodynamics, material science engineering, fluid mechanics, atmospheric sciences, polymer science in engineering. Now, among that, as a food technology students, we have food technology as a one optional that is XCG. Now, thermodynamics or fluid me mechanics, anyone we can choose. Generally, we as a students we recommend thermodynamics uh, to choose. Why? Because it has a little bit, uh, you know, uh, 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 resemblance in food engineering. Also, use of concepts in food engineering. Also, in a first year, any food engineering students and food technology students study the you know, basic thermodynamics. Now, in Excel domain, the same. Uh, the what we have in common is general aptitude. Now everything changes except food technology that is optional. Now chemistry goes for twenty five marks. Here there is a difference. In XC mathematics was of fifteen marks. Now in chemistry in Excel it is of twenty five marks. So that goes for that that counts for forty marks altogether. Now our food technology in Excel becomes thirty marks. And other optional which we have microbiology, geology, botany, and biochemistry that also goes for thirty marks. So generally, what we recommend at Agrivision for you, for you know choosing microbiology or biochemistry again we also study in our B Tech for technology and that also has little bit of you know food microbiology uh, a little bit concepts are similar in in microbiology. So that's also helps. So this is the basic differences between Gate XC and Excel. Now we as a student, we can appear in third year, we can appear in fourth year. Also, we can appear any time after graduation. Now this is a bit information about Gate XC and Excel for for technology students where they can appear, what streams that they they can choose. Now we are going to bring a series of uh, videos on Gate XC Excel. If you like this video, hit subscribe button. And uh, follow on other social media uh, channels. If you are a student who are preparing for GET for technology, uh, connect on the number given on the uh, screen.
थैंक यू सी यू